Alright guys, hi, I'm El Worfi. Welcome to the show. Zoink, I don't know, something cool, funny buzzword. Breaking the ice, you know, ice breakers, yeah. And I actually ran into, I, uh, so I just got off the phone, uh, and I now have something to talk about, actually. Telemarketers. That's right, story time. I used to be a telemarketer. Yes, really. Why do you think I, I love being, in, you know, talking to you guys, and, you know, I can just kind of say whatever, and I don't really care what people are going to say, because when you're a telemarketer, you kind of get to the point where you're like, hey, you know, can I, can, can I help you and stuff, you know, you get, you get really quiet, and then you, you're like, oh, oh okay, you, you don't care about what I'm saying, okay, bye, you know, you get, you're super shy and stuff, totally fine, look, it happens to everyone, everyone gets shy, you know, the whole, I, I'm not here to make you feel feel better in that sense. I'm just here to be like, look, I, I'm trying to sell you some. If you don't want to buy it, you know, whatever. No skin on my back. Or no skin off my back. You know, you can't make people buy your product. You know, that's not how that works. People need to understand that telemarketing is usually not the best way to sell things. But it was actually about a survey. Um, I, it's this lady, so she calls about a survey about radio stations in, in my area, you know, and she's like looking for a female 30 to 55, and I'm like, oh, I was thinking about it, I'm like, that's an interesting study, you know, uh, they're going to be talking about radio for like, you know, middle-aged women and stuff, I'm like, alright, cool, I mean, no one in my house was there, so it was a fairly quick phone call, but it was just kind of that thing of like, well, shoot, I, I guess radio must be dying then, because they wouldn't be conducting a survey about radio if, um, you know, like, say they, they had done studies and they found out women of that age were their biggest audience. Maybe they're losing them. Probably going to be, uh, I bet you the questions would have been like, oh, look, you know, what do you listen to, you know? Wh what makes you want to listen to them? And, I mean, I, I listen to the radio. I listen to 98.9. It's a rock station. You just, they just play rock music. I don't have to think about it. Don't need to worry about, you know, if it's good or bad, because it's all, always going to be good. And if it's bad, just turn off the radio. Just turn it off. Nothing wrong with not watching. Nothing wrong with not watching something if you don't like it. Who would have thought? Look at that. Look at that. It looks like it's alive. It's not because there's no cubicles and stuff in it yet, but look at that. It's alive. So anyway, yeah, so uh, it just seems weird because I've, I've done, st I participated in those studies because I'm, you know, when I was a telemarketer, I, I was, okay, so I was campaigning, right? I, I campaigned for, uh, let's see, one, two, three. Sorry, one second. Uh, yeah. Just gotta make sure I do it right. Gotta make sure actually I build this right. You know, I don't wanna make it bad or anything. Yeah. Boom. Boom. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Sorry. Sorry. Totally. I probably totally killed the momentum. Okay. Back on track. Uh, so I was telemarketer, I was campaigning for, um, you know, okay, so, I'm a Democrat, by the way, just so you know, if you, that's a problem for you, sorry, but, uh, I am, and, uh, so I was campaigning for the Democrats, and I was like, hey, I did, I was phone banking, right, so I was, like, on the phone, and I was calling people, and I'd be, the first thing I would always tell them, I'd be like, hey, is so-and-so there, because, uh, what they did, it was really creepy, they gave me a list of names of people who were, who were there, right, and I was like, hey, and they were like, oh, you know, hey, hey, like, what's, what's up? And I was just kind of like, I, I don't know why the, 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 these, how these campaign people got the names of and addresses and phone numbers of all these people. So I was like, hey, are you so-and-so who lives at so-and-so? And they are like, yeah, why? What, what, what the heck is going on? Who are you? And I'd be like, oh, yeah, I'm not here to sell you anything, so don't hang up. But it's kind of a survey poll test, you know, and I'd be like, yeah, yeah, you know. It's just really awkward. I felt, I felt bad doing it, too. I didn't necessarily enjoy it. I mean, it was fun in the moment. In the moment, I'll admit, I had fun. I was calling people, you know, helping out, you know, support. Support the people. Got to do it for the people, right? Yeah, but, um, no, uh, that was, that was not a very good, wasn't very good. Why? Two, three, four, five. Um, it wasn't good because, one, it just felt, I felt rude. I felt like I was being kind of rude. You know what I mean? Alright. 
that right? I mean, heck, wait, wait, yes, yes, yes. Sorry, I want to. I want to finish the story. Trust me. I just. I want to make sure I build this right. Okay, so from that pillar, yes. The door over there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight out. Okay. And it. Right, 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 right. Yes. See, that, that this reception thing is like the hardest thing I have to build, uh, actually. Uh, which is kind of funny. Kind of not. Kind of funny. Take it as you will. Looks more, more light now. Yes. Block there. Okay, I can see there, sort of. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Um. Okay. Uh. Crap. Train of thought lost. I apologize. I. I will remember it, and I will feel like an idiot later. Okay. So we'll let me be an idiot later for now. But as we'll talk about, uh, I don't know. Um. Dungeons and Dragons. Screw it. We're talking about Dungeons and Dragons now. Totally change the topic. Just go with it. Just go with it. No, is it weird? Nah, but go with it. Whatever. We'll fix it later. We'll fix it later. We'll find the. We'll find our place. Just not now. Cause. Cause yeah. Not now. Later. Later. We will. So anyway, Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah. Um. So I, I love it. I think it is a wonderful game. Actually, uh, I have a lot of fun with that. And uh, I don't know. I've always kind of. I, I, well, I l obviously I liked it. I mean, it's not like I don't like it or anything, but. You know what I mean? How you're you're kind of like, oh, well, that's fun. You know, you, you you play in it, and you know it starts out kind of kind of weird, but but then it, as you progress, it gets more. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm really focused on building this thing, and I don't want to build it off camera because I want you to get the full experience and really understand. Because uh, in the end, I guess the culminating thing to, that you, I want you to take away from this. Okay, so, one in the front. There was window in the middle. And then... Okay, back corner. Okay, it's more empty than I thought it was. It doesn't have to be the same, but I'd like it to be the same. Similar. It's like two companies. There'll be different buildings, too. Don't worry. Um, not that one. So that means there's going to be... That's not it. Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right, and then an exit there. Just this is just a one-way exit. This is like a staff thing. Perfect. Woo! Uh, yes. Yeah, so Dungeons and Dragons. So uh, I play. I've been playing Dungeons and Dragons for a while. Uh, I really like it. Uh, my gaming group has recently been kind of falling off uh, the rails a bit, which sucks. Because I really like Dungeons and Dragons. It's a lot of fun. If you haven't played Dungeons and Dragons, go go play Dungeons and Dragons. It's a fun game. You know, just just go play it. No 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 real excuse here. You gotta just go play the game. It's fun. You're not, I'm not leading you astray or anything. You know, it's you will ha be happy. You will enjoy it. You'll feel like a badass when you're slaying those those monsters and things. And it just makes you you you, you feel great. You know what I mean? You just feel great. That's what matters. Is that you're happy. And while you're you're going through your, your day being hecka happy, you know, you really you get to meet people, you have fun experiences, and you're like, hey, this was pretty fun. You know? It was it was pretty fun. And uh Yeah. Yeah, I I, I really like it. I like Dungeons and Dragons. It's fun. 
really we gotta it's gotta it's gotta become more out there. It's gotta get become part of the mainstream of gaming. Well, I mean, it's, it kind of is. Let's see here, is that? Yeah. Is this how we're doing it? Yes. Sure, this one can be a little wonky. Whatever, whatever. It it doesn't matter. Not really. Kind of does. Kind of does. Kind of doesn't. Oh, oh, that's why it's off. This one's not supposed to be like that. You're supposed to be like that. Okay. Yeah, because I was like, why the heck is it so lopsided? Oh, that's because I'm doing it wrong. It's because I'm doing it wrong. No wonder. No wonder it's weird. When you do something wrong, it, it just goes wrong. Okay, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you get the, the three. So you're like, boom, boom, boom. Boom. There we go. And there, there. There. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Two. One, two, three, four. Offices. Don't you just love offices? I think they look. I think they look great. Especially if I ever make an apocalypse game out of this, where I'll I'll purposely load it with zombies and then give myself, you know, limited resources. And I'll have to like I'll I'm gonna do something cool with this when it's all done. It'll be fun. You'll see. It'll be fun. Trust me. Hooray for fun. It's just fun. Okay? Yeah. Deal with it. We're gonna have fun. Okay, uh... So yeah, Dungeons and Dragons, we're playing and stuff. And then we get to this point where... I realize that my character has been the longest surviving character... Just because I haven't taken as many risks. So I'm like, alright. Let's take some risks. You know, no one else is dying. No, no one else is having to suffer... Anything? What the hell? Okay. So from the elevator, there's a ring. And a T. Is there a single hallway? No, there isn't. No, I made it much more efficient than this. Damn it! Okay. So you're good. You have the T block over there where it's... Oh, can I just make this more efficient? Nah. Nah, let's make it cornered off, kind of. This should be more of like a private one. Yes. So I was right in the fact that this one... Right? Sorry, I'm talking to myself. Um, but yes, that's the way it was designed. Yes. Company company brand office supplies, guys. Got a lot of fun. Have fun with your, your space. Yeah. Office space. Really? Is that how it goes? Or just that extra long... No, there isn't. <sighs> Crap, did I mess up the dimensions? No. Did I mess up the dimensions? That's right. Like that? No. Hold on. That's an L. No! It's not an L. Well, kind of is. There's a dog walking around. Wait, is it a one hallway gap or a two hallway gap? There's two hallway, it comes up and Oh it needs to be over one more, maybe. Over one more. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yes, there we go. Perfect. So I was like, what why is it lopsided? Why is it wrong? Oh, that's why it's wrong. It just I just built it the wrong way. Hello dog walking around, being loud, you being a loud dog? It's fine. You're silly and weird. You're a good dog. Dogs need to get more respect. Damn it. Dog love. Gotta love your dogs. Don't. If you're not nice to your dog, you're a terrible person. As far as I'm concerned. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, where it takes up way too much space and it seems absolutely ridiculous to have a cubicle that big. Whatever. Who cares? It's fine. Then you get into the, the cool sky, sky building thing which will also be amazing. Who wouldn't love 
an awesome sky building thing. I think we're just going to call this rant. Just, that's what it's going to be. It's a rant. Honestly, it is. I'm just ranting about stuff. Not sure why. Just talking about things that I may or may not care about. Who knows? Who knows what's going on in the noggin? All that matters is you're having fun. Having fun, being cool. Make sure there's like a, yeah, there's a cubicle there. With a chest and a desk. Yeah, because this, yeah, because you're using up all this space. And it goes, uh huh, yep, yep, the double. Okay, I'll pat the dog. I'm going to pat the dog, everybody. We're going to pat the dog. I'm going to move around and stuff so that way you can know that I haven't left the computer at all or anything like that because that would just be terrible because I'm not going to leave you guys hanging uh, for nothing. Uh, that would be really bad. You know, uh, don't want to be making things seem worse. Yeah, and then you got the spider monkey. Yeah, because the windows don't have to necessarily match up with the... Um, the theme. Make it out one more extension. Yes. We are building, guys. Check that out. Look at us constructing out of things out of materials. Hooray. And then what's left in here? What's left? L. L. Well, okay, let's do the L from here. with that locked in, and then maybe... how would it be? Yeah, it'd be like that, wouldn't it? How it's all kind of weird. Where you think it, you think it seems kind of normal, but then it's, it's not. Then you got this awkwardness. Yes! Perfect! It's awkward, but it's not. Perfect. Okay, and then you go up here. The fourth one. Woo! We are making, we are making some progress, guys. And you know what? Ugh! Stretch. I'm stretching, and I think we're gonna call it uh, call it here for an episode, guys. So anyway, as always, I'm your host, L. Worthy, and I will see you guys next time.